Most of the handy van riders need to get to work, doctor's appointments, even to the grocery store, but many of them don't have driver's licenses and their friends and family are busy working. So that's where the volunteers at Handy Van step in. Uh, this will be the, uh, the receptionist area where she takes the telephone calls. Here's Merle's runs for next week. This is the Handy Van headquarters in Brookville. Uh, you see today, it uh, looks like there's only what? Eight or ten. Runs are scheduled here for nearly 30 drivers, all of them volunteers. You take it, take it seriously, and Walt schedules us, and, and okay, we'll drive. And Today, driver Bud Boyer is headed on two runs. He first picks up Amy. Right, right here on the corner. Amy has Down syndrome, but rides to her job at Wendy's five days a week. <laughs> How's your mom? She doing okay? Without drivers like Bud, Amy probably couldn't keep a job. I appreciate it. You, you, you talk with them and said, what would we do without Brookville Handyman? It's only the transportation they have. After he drops off Amy, Bud heads to the other side of town to pick up two riders from work. There's a will, there's a way. Hey, you're not working, Stan right? Clark's been riding with Handyman for more than five years. They take me to this week and pick me up from work. It helps their body out. Handy Van began in the early 1990s. It worked solely on donations, fundraising, and grant money. The drivers cover dozens of miles a day with a service area reaching from Lewisburg to Inglewood and from New Lebanon to the Montgomery Miami County line. Volunteers say the work brings something even better than a paycheck. It kind of gets in your blood, I think. We have a lot, a lot of people that have joined us. And they really appreciate the time that they can do. Every now and then you get a, you get a writer, and, and uh, when you take them back to their home and they get out and, and they give you a hug, that uh, that's pretty good. <laughs> That is pretty good. If you could use help from Handy Van Ministries, or if you'd like to volunteer yourself, you can give them a call at 833-2260. There's also a Handy Van branch in Trotwood. Reporting live, I'm Holly Samuels. Two news on your side.